Gaffer, a tough result to take, but firstly, how's David Davis? Yeah, we don't know the answer to that one at the moment. We need to, we need to see how he is. But at, at this moment in time, um, it, it, it wasn't a good one, you know. And for Digger to come off, um, you know, he, he actually jarred it yesterday in training. Um, but I don't know if it was, you know, the way he fell again today that that opened it up. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. We need to look back at that one. I've just looked at it quickly. Um, but I haven't seen the camera angle we get doesn't give us what what he's done and what he's which way he's gone and if he's rolled it or just jarred it. So um, yeah, tough one for us to take after a after a really really good start. I thought we were I thought we were excellent. Um, you know, then we have the injury to deal with, then we have the sending off to deal with, and then it's a, it's a different game then. And we were in it, you know, right until the death. It was the first real free shot that they managed to get um, a, a look at our goal late in the game, and that's um, that's heartbreaking for everybody. Losing two starting players is always going to make it tough. And as you said, your side was still in it till the end of the game. It, they reacted so well. Well, that's that's what you have to do. You know, the, you know, you have to stay in the game for them moments. I mean, there was. There was moments in the second half where we could have scored again, um, but you, you do have to take the most of those moments because they're going to be few and far between the longer the game goes on. And it was just, you know, just right at the end, you know, when he gets, you know, they bring on a Serb and he ends up chopping a couple of our lads and it's working their thighs and we just can't get out to that extra man on the edge of the box and he gets a free shot at goal, um, which is the first one they had. And it was, uh, it was a credit to our boys that they never... They never let that happen. Is it? They were a real credit to themselves today. Yeah, we... and, the, and the football club. Mm. Yeah, and the fans were brilliant as well. You know, they helped them a lot tonight and, and kept them in the game. And um, you know, for for whatever it is, you know, I don't I don't think we get the the rub of the green um, with some of the refereeing performances that we've had this season. We don't get the rub of the green. That's not me saying, by the way. I don't think. Josh Vellers was a red card. I think what's happened is there was an opportunity to kick the ball out and Josh wants to stop the game. And I think where he's gone in there, I think at the speed that he's gone in, it wasn't a high tackle. I just think the speed that he's gone in, that's what the referee deemed as a, as a red card. There were, I mean, as a, as a team performance, it was fantastic. A couple of players I'd like to pick out. Tom Bloxham getting 76 minutes. How do you think he fared today? No, he was great. At the end of the day, you just got, you know, what happens to Tom is he, he'll, he'll get that cramp as the game goes on. And I, I thought he was, I thought he was excellent today. He's, he's weighted and he's needed to build that energy up and come again. And for 18, you know, he's just a fantastic prospect for, for us. And um, I think what will happen is Tom Bloxham will actually it'll actually sink in with him what he's achieved at the start of next season. It'll take the summer for him to look back on everything that he's learned. And, um, you know, they, they show good spirit with him as well, the boys, because there'll be times where he'll, he'll make a mistake. But all in all, you know, they, they love him. The boys love him. We all do. And um, as we do with all, all of our younger players, him and Charlie Caton and all those boys that come up from the, from the youth team. So... Yeah, he's doing very, very well. But later on, what happens to Tom is he tends to get a bit of cramp. And what you don't want that to do is you don't want that to become a six-week injury where you leave him on too long and he tears a calf muscle or something like that. Every player on the pitch works so hard. They yeah. seem like they put everything into that 90 minutes. Yeah, just as I just said to him in there, you know, I think there's... And, and it's not really a mistake, um, but we give them one look at our goal with 10 men for, you know, what was the sending off, 30 minutes? So there's an hour we've played for a long time and um, I thought the boys were excellent tonight. The first 20, 30 minutes, I thought we were excellent and probably should have scored again. Had we done that, I definitely think we wouldn't have lost the game tonight. Um, so I'm really, I'm really disappointed for, for the boys tonight, for the effort they've put in. Um, Big thanks and well done to the crowd for helping the boys out there tonight. I thought they were, I thought they were brilliant tonight, and um, I'm just sorry for those those groups of people really tonight.
Thank you for your time, Gaffer. Thank you.